Hey everyone, Alex here with Carter Products. Now today I want to talk to you about tires for your bandsaw. Now tires come in two different uh, materials. We've got rubber and urethane. Now rubber and urethane give you the exact same performance. The only difference is urethane will last a little bit longer and you don't have to glue them down. Now rubber tires come in 6 to 42 inch and urethane tires come in 10 to 20 inch. Now if you live in an extremely dry climate um, your rubber may not be the way to go just because it dry rots a little bit easier and that's where a urethane tire will outperform definitely over rubber. But I want to show you the easy way to install these. Urethane tires, uh, everybody has been told you got to do all these different things just to be able to put a urethane tire on. I want to show you an easy way to install them. So we'll take this out of the package. Set that off to the side. Now everybody's got these little clamps in their shop. They're handy for all kinds of different things. Use these. It'll make it very easy to install this tire on the wheel. So what I normally do is I'll just take one, clamp it into place. I'll stretch that about as far as I can possibly stretch it and put a second one on. Now, stretch it just about an inch or two at a time. Maybe even a fourth one. And if you don't have a real good grip, maybe even a fifth. So we'll just slide that a little bit further on, clamp that into place. But generally, when you've got it to this point, it makes it pretty easy to stretch over. Take those off. Finish pushing that right on the wheel. Now remember, urethane tires are a little bit more narrow than a rubber tire, so you're going to have a little bit of gap on one side or the other, but that's all it takes to install a urethane tire. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe for news, tips, and product updates. Follow the link in the description to explore all the great tools that Carter Products has to offer.